Imagine if you have a YouTube channel just like this, posting YouTube shorts about daily facts every day, and you will be making $50,000 a month. So if you see over here, it's just posting about psychological facts over here, about relationships, etc. And I'll show you a technique, a system that you can create 100 YouTube shorts in 10 minutes for free using AI tools. So if we have a look at this YouTube channel, what it's posting is all about YouTube shorts, about different facts. So over here, five clear signs someone likes you a lot, four signs you're super attractive, and then sometimes the person you want the most, and then followed by the answer. So over here, you could see that it's more of quotes that really like picks a person's curiosity. And all it's doing is simply text over here with a nice background and as well on the top, stating that, okay, is it a male fact? Is it a sad fact? Is it a psychology fact over here? So it's just the category on top. And if I scroll down right now, all it's doing is just that, right? You could see a lot of facts and in YouTube shorts as well over here. And the really nice thing with this, it is was able to amass like 200,000 subscribers and it's also making more than $50,000 per month. So I want to show you a system that's using AI tools for free in just three easy steps that allows you to create 100 YouTube shorts in 10 minutes. So you could just rinse and repeat the system to continue to churn out these types of shorts very quickly and you can create them into your own channel. Step one is using ChatGPT to generate the code for us in bulk. Now, the really cool thing with ChatGPT is it's a free AI tool that you can use and quickly sign up for and then ask it to write or do anything for you. Now, over here with ChatGPT, what we want to happen is to create something similar to this, okay? Just a quick quote or quotation, okay, that will get the curiosity of our viewers and then write multiple examples for us. So what I'll do is I'll place in over here and run this template that you can use as well so that you can start creating, okay, the different quotations as well that you need. So it really depends on what the main theme of your channel is all about. In our case, we want it to be similar to this one, like all about relationships, okay, over here. So which is why I'm asking it to write 10 relationship fact quotes. But in your case, you can just change this. So let's say cooking or let's say about pets, okay, you can just change this template and then run this right away to get started quickly inside ChatGPT. So let's get over, like go over quickly on what this prompt or this like set of instructions is all about. So each code will be made of two short sentences. And then the first sentence is, should make it intriguing for our viewers to read the second part. So we want it to be a hook, okay? And then the next one, right? is that the coach should target people in their 20s. So we want it like for our specific target audience, okay? So you can just update this to match your audience as well. Now the coach should cover various aspects of relationships, including dating, marriage, friendships, and general relationship advice. So pretty much the different categories, okay? That what our quotation will be about. So you can also specify which ones that are related to your niche. Now, aim for a mix of informative and humorous content. And then for each code you will be creating, okay, we want to provide the title and then the first part of the quotation and the second part of the quotation, right? And then include an additional column, including the aspect of the relationship facts so that we can just quickly categorize, okay, our different quotations. Now it's very quick because I press enter and what I have here right now is that all of the 10 quotations, okay, right, that has been created by ChatGPT for us, okay? So for example, the dating dilemma, that's a title, and then the quotation, swipe left or swipe right. And then remember, compatibility is more than just a profile picture. So it's, it's really cool, okay? It's catchy as well, because this is the hook, okay? And then this is the answer that completes the quotation, right? So you can just use this right now and then start creating videos. So you see, like, Right now, we already have 10, so you just need to rinse and repeat this one to create 100 in no time or even more, okay? Okay, so what I did right now was I added like a couple more examples over here as ChatGPT to create more for me. And one thing that I didn't like was that the formatting, okay? It's not really in a table format because we will need this later, okay, to work our magic. So what I did was I simply asked ChatGPT like, we write this in a table format that I could copy paste into Excel and it just updated this into this one. So you can see, right, the title, okay, like what the topic is all about. And then the first part of the code and then the second part, 
right? And then the specific category or aspect of the specific quotation. Now, if I scroll down and say, I don't like the quotation marks as well in our quotes, okay? So what I did was I simply asked it to rewrite this and remove the quotation marks and it just updated this for me. So that's a really cool because it's now ready for me to just simply copy paste this, okay, into our next step. So one thing that you might be wondering is how was I able to create this specific like prompt over here or set of instructions? And I have a separate tutorial as well that I will share in the link in the description on how you can master chat GPT quickly so that you can start creating like detailed prompts like this, okay, in no time, in just a couple of minutes. Step two is to use Canva to create a sample YouTube short very quickly. And the really nice thing with Canva, as you can see over here, is we can open a free account and then you can start like searching for YouTube shorts templates over here and then just select one and then once you see that really fits your team, then you can just customize it like very quickly. Okay, so the really nice thing over here is, for example, let's say we want this one, okay, because we're talking about relationships, this is like really serene. So we can just click on it and then start customizing this. So I have this open right now and what we want to have is simply two lines for our quotation to show up over here, right? So if you recall, we have our first part over here and then we have our second part and then we can also show the title as well over here. So what I'll do right now is this is like our quotation, right? And then I'll just copy paste this over here, right? And then we can add another like title over here. So let's say this is our title, okay? And then we have our quotation right in the middle, right? Okay, and then this is our quotation. So let's say this is our first part, okay? So what I'm doing right now is I'm just like showing you right now how it would look like for our YouTube short, okay? Now, if we play this, okay? So what's going to happen is the title and the first part will show up, right? And then what we want to do is to have a second part as well show up over here. So what I'll do is let me just copy this and then paste right now, okay? And then let's paste this over here. And then let's say this is our second part. Now, what we want to adjust is the timings of our text, okay? So for our first part, let's say we want to edit the timing. So let's just right click and show timing over here. And then let's say we want our first part to show on for about 4.5 seconds, okay? And what we want to happen is, let's say, let's just adjust the timing of our second part. And then it will show up for the last 1.5 seconds of the video. Because what we want to happen is our second part to like show up very quickly. Okay, so it will just show up briefly so that for our viewers, they will replay our shorts more than once, okay, to be able to see that video, okay? So that's one thing as well that we want it to be viewed more than one time, okay? So let's just play this, okay? So we see our first part over here, right? And then after that, it will disappear and the second part will show up, okay? So we just adjusted the timings to work on that quickly for our entire quotation. So that's really quick, right? In just a couple of clicks over here, and then now we have our template for our YouTube Shorts. So if you're liking this, don't forget to like and subscribe. And then all of the links, like all of the tools, AI tools are in the description. And I also have a free ebook for you that you can learn the top four ways to earn passive income. So links are all in the description. Step three is now the magical part, which is bulk creation inside Canva. So to be able to work with bulk creation, you would need a Canva Pro account. But the really cool thing with this one is there is a free 30-day trial for Canva Pro that you can just get it for free, right? And then start utilizing this and making the most of the 30 days. So use the link in my description as well so that you can get that free 30-day trial. So the really cool thing with this one is that when it comes to our codes, what I did was I copy pasted this one, the one that ChatGPT gave me. And now we're going to use Canva to start creating multiple shorts based on the entire table that I will give it. Now, to be able to do that, let's go to apps over here, okay? And then select bulk create over here. You can see this tool, okay? And then we're gonna add our data. I've already copy pasted the table. Now let's select enter data manually, okay, over here and start populating our table. Now, we want our structure to be the same as what we have instructed chat GPT to create for us. So the first one over here is our title, right? And let's add text. And then over here, we have our first part, okay? And then we have our second part over here. And then for the last one is our aspect. 
And what I'll do right now is I already copy pasted, right? Our output from ChatGPT. I'll just go control V over here and paste it as well. Now we have this, we don't need this specific row. So let's just delete that specific row over here. Then we have our 10 outputs as well, okay? So the really cool thing is if we have 100 codes over here, then you can also generate 100 shorts right away. Now let's click done over here, okay? So now that we have four like data fields over here, which is pretty much the four columns that we have for our chat GPT output, what we will do right now is link the text boxes to our data over here, okay? So to be able to do that, so for example, let's say this one, this title, we want to link our title as well of our data table. So what I'll do is I'll just right click on this, okay? And then there is the connect data option. We want to connect it to the title that we have gotten from ChatGPT. Now, let's do that. And it has updated to that. Now, this is the first part. So let's right click on this, select connect data, and select the first part over here. Okay, so you can see that there's the curly braces over here, which means that this specific field content is now like linked to the data table that we have. Now, for the second part, do the same thing. Just go for right click, connect data, and then let's go for the second part over here. Now, let's just move this back here, okay? Because this is where the location that we want our text to show up. Now, okay, we have our three fields linked up. Aspect is not really that important right now, but if you want to show it as well over here, it's up to you. And we're pretty happy with this one. Let's click continue, okay? And then we have all of the 10 codes that we have over here. And once we're happy, let's click generate. Now, the really magical thing over here is since we have it linked, okay, what Canva will do right now is it will now generate all of the 10, okay, YouTube shorts over here using that data and then creating it 10 times. Okay, so if you see over here, right, there are 10 YouTube shorts and it has now worked with the 10 quotations that we have specified. So if I click play over here, you can see, right, you want to know if you're compatible and then it will show Take them to grocery shopping. It reveals a lot. Next one is looking for your soulmate. Okay, and then it will show try finding someone, etc. Okay, and then the next one, the friendship boost over here. Okay, and then it will start like creating all of this YouTube shorts very quickly. Okay, the married life over here, right? That's number four. And then we have the trust meter, which is number five, right? Okay, and then it shows as well the answer. And then number six is the first date. So if we jump over here, right? This is the first thing, as you can see over here. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, and we are able to generate right now 10, like very quickly, 10 YouTube short videos over here, okay? So imagine if you have 100, if you have 200, right? You can use the same technique to quickly, okay? Just place the data over here, and then it will generate all of the pages for you. The only caveat though, is that based on the template that you have, okay? All of the backgrounds, okay, will be the same for all of your generated videos. So let's say we're happy with 10 videos having this flower background, but let's say we want to change this to another one. Then you can simply change like search for different elements. Let's say like a car or let's city light background over here. Okay, video, and you can just like search for it quickly. Okay, that's a really nice thing. You can just search for videos over here and you can just change this or drag it over here, right? So let's say this is not exactly city lights, but let's change that. And you can just drag this over here and then update your video over here, okay? And then once you update that, you can start generating 10 more, okay? But also take note that this video over here for your shorts, it will simply follow the length of the selected video. So for example, 30 seconds is too long. You can just update this and then drag this to make this shorter, let's say around six or 10 seconds, depending up to you. Now you can just rinse and repeat the process and then start updating your data over here and then generate more YouTube Shorts videos. And you can do this very quickly because you just simply need to copy paste from ChatGPT over here and then start pasting inside Canva and then generate the videos and you can download all of this right now. So if you want to learn how to use ChatGPT as well to create your own YouTube longer videos, then please watch this video next.